Hey, it's Julie with SB Pace back for more Project 365. And we're continuing on with Business Foundation this month. The question I have today is, what does it mean to begin with the end in mind? Great question. One of my favorites. Honestly, this one is so fundamental to your business. When you are starting out with a business, or if you've already have one that's in place, you really need to be thinking about the end, right? What does the end mean? Do you, what sort of exit strategy do you have in place? What can Under what conditions would you exit? And what do you want your business to look like at that point? Because that's really what you're trying to do is you're trying to grow your business to the point of being able to exit from it. Now, I know a lot of you are going, but I just started my business. I don't want to exit it. Well, that's okay. But having understanding an end point gives you the unique ability to be able to build towards it. So if you're like, well, if I hit, you know, $10 million in revenues consistently for 24 straight months, I would sell my business. Awesome. Now all you have to do is build a plan to get you to the 10 million in revenue for 24 straight months. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You can totally do this. So beginning with the end in mind helps you to know one, under what conditions you would exit. And trust me, you want to do that before somebody makes an offer on your business or before you get to the point where you're super emotional about it. So think about that, what that end looks like for you, what your big picture goals are for the business. And it's more than just having an exit strategy or a buy sell agreement. It's also having a plan for what, how you're going to grow that business. How many employees do you want to have? How, how much are your revenues? What sort of services or products are you wanting to put out into the marketplace? And I know that will evolve over time because as you know, the world moves at a very fast pace, but quite honestly, these are the things you need to think about when you're beginning with the end in mind, and it's the best way to build a business. So do it, just do it. And we will see you tomorrow for more Project 365.